All right, well, the adult is taming up a lot quicker than the juvenile. Yeah, that one's still hungry, or still waiting after the first feed. This one, I've given it two more feeds. Hey, but we got... Not one of them, anyway. So, get, get your ass back here. Thank you. And still wait till it's, you know, wait until it's hungry. I'm not sure what's going on with you. You've got a really good weight stat, though. How did your father's stats come in? 38 points into health, 37 points into melee. Okay. Yeah, that's just good like it is. 15, Mizzletosaur. See a manta circling around over there. That's a 150 aberrant manta. Still nothing. Well, you're also a male, so I could really care less about you. You have a really good weight stat, though. <laughs> 26 points of oxygen, wow. Uh, let's go ahead and look at our sharks, though. We've got yeah, 39 points in melee, uh, 34 stamina. 38 weight, 39 weight, okay, 40 weight, oh, what's our highest health, 34, that uh, looks like 34 points is our highest health, I thought I had a high health one too, but I guess not, yeah, still doesn't even say, you know, ready to eat on the spyglass, so. Yeah, went back to base, repaired everything, hatched up some creatures. I've got a perfect pair of postosuchus now. Ex postos. And uh I need to tame more because yeah, their highest stat is thirty points into health. Which uh postos you get the same way as Dononicus, Postosuchus. Uh you steal eggs from a nest. So you don't get the additional tamed levels on top of it, so yeah, their stats are really not that great. Point-wise, anyway. They are fun creatures to run around on, though. They're actually really good at caves, as long as the cave doesn't require any jumping, because, well, they can't. And all the times I've been over here, I've just been getting... Completely just destroyed by... Well, no, not really destroyed. I mean, honestly, my berry's at full health. <laughs> so, uh, but, you know, just ganged up on, I guess would be a better term. Uh, Megalodons, and now there's none whatsoever. There is that, yeah, 150 Aberrant Manta over there. I thought mantas were a passive tame, not a knockout tame. <laughs> Juvenile manta running around still. Yeah, tameable passive. Why do the aberrant ones say knockout? Would you, like, finally get hungry? As soon as he does get hungry, his, his food has dropped enough that it's going to be this pretty rapid fire on feeding a kibble. But, uh. It's taking forever. Now I need to find a high level female, the little sore. That's a 130 male. With meh stats. But I think I will go kill it. Encourage a different one to spawn in in his place. Is that a... Yeah, there's a leads like this through the weeds. And...
Ah, I bet that's the blubber right there. Uh, gun. Yep. I'll get rid of that. You have another level. Sweet. Get rid of that. And now we gotta do this dance again. Still no luck on the Bazillasaur. <laughs> We're finding a female. Any female. There's a... Oh, okay, I wondered why it was glowy. That's not cool. I was gonna say there's it's all red and st oh hello, please you sore. Looks like my berry didn't get radiation poisoning. Alright, so underwater radiation. That is just not cool. I'm sorry. You gotta choose between a radiation suit or scuba. Okay, no. Yeah, my berry is not being affected by the radiation. Just me. Probably my sino as well, but... Yeah, and there's like all sorts of Arasukulasukas running around here, which is kind of cool. Hello, you reptrids. remember how to tame the kulas off the top of my head. I think they're a passive tame, actually. Alright, but yeah, we are... This is basically the swamp here, so... 14 points in a... 28 points in a movement speed. You are just a stellar megalodon. I did finally find a good megalodon. 33... You jackhole. Hit 25 points wild. You got 8 points when you level, or uh, when you got tamed. Ah, okay, I didn't find a good, you know, health megalodon yet. Okay, and there. Now we're getting back into the X creatures, it looks like. One fifty with twenty eight points into health. Okay. You have twenty seven. I should tame them both. Okay, level twenty. You need to go first. Is your pack boosting everybody? So that's just not cool. Spassy, and it's still a male. All right, let me. This is, yeah, the fun parts here. What I could do is stun. Okay, now let's see who's not stunned. What the hell is that up there? An Amargosaur in the water. Okay. Get the hell out of here, Ichthyosaurs. There's that 25 right next to it. You're dead. Okay. I did hit the one I want to tame, but... I'm going for health anyway, so... That'll be fine with it.
You're out. Okay. Now, where did I leave the other guys at? There. 28 points into health. And 26, but it's an X Megalodon. That is a regular Basilisaur, 95 male. Uh, Twenty eight points. Come on, twenty eight. Let's do this. Dang it. And you're being pack boosted, so you're taking less torpor than normal. yourself. You know what? You're going down. There we go. That's that X Megalodon. You're level 20 as well. Take care of you real quick. You're 95. I don't want you, so you have to wait till the pack breaks up a bit and then go pick off the weaker ones as you can. Like, this guy is now leaving the pack. He's just like, yeah, whatever. I'm bored, right? So the darker one needs to go. Okay, what are you? You're an adolescent 140. Okay. That's the 130 that I was shooting. So that's good. Give her another pop or two here. Oh, there's a 25. Get him. All right. Uh, why did you have to get involved, X Megalodon? Okay, now you're sleeping. All right, you have aggroed onto me, which is great, right? Where did you guys all come from? One fifty. Uh, you got twenty seven points into melee, but Yeah, we're only doing 107 damage right now. That one is for 28 health, so I need to not drag these guys over there. Hey guys. Hold still for a minute, would you? All right, guys. Anybody not stunned, follow me.
You get the hell out of here. Nobody likes you, Ichthyosaur. Yeah, we are set for food for a while now, though. Alright, level 100's broke off. There we go. Uh, yeah, you have that good melee, so I'm kind of tempted. You have a decent health, but I've got a, a higher health one knocked out, so we'll... Eliminate you from the gene pool here. Thank you. You are the high melee, so... Okay, you're 25. I should be able to take you out relatively quickly, even with the pack boost being a thing. There we go. You're 90. Alright. Getting easier now. Getting easier. Why did you guys have to come over here? That's what I was saying. But more! Ah, this is... Yeah. <laughs> what I've been dealing with a lot here. I don't know why I'm going after that guy. He's not hack boosting, so... making progress on this. What are you, 25 at 135? Can you get this guy out of here? Nope. There we go. Keep piling in. <laughs> Why? The aggro range on these guys is insane as well. You're juvenile. That might be part of the reason why I keep getting all these guys showing up. Um, right, you... You were the chubby food one, so you need to get out of here. There we go. 135, with nothing good going on. Let's just... Bully you a little bit here. Three five with really nothing good going on. I need to get this stuff out of here. I'm swimming too slow. All right. Ninety five. 150. That's the melee one. I don't know if he's got enough health left for me to tame at this point or not. It's the juvenile. Will you a little bit while I'm here, I guess. Okay, your torpidity is fine. Level 20 by itself. All right. One down. What are you? You're the 135 with nothing going on. All right. Guess what? Without the pack boost, it's really easy to take out Megalodons. <laughs> with the pack boost, though.
There's another Megalodon over there. That's the 150 is over there. Okay, good. I only got that expert out. You are one thirty. Go away. You are the 150. I don't... Yeah, you don't have enough health. Ah, uh, the downside is that, you know... Baryonyx, like, auto-harps to everything, so... Um, right. What are you doing all the way over there? Jerk. Are you coming for me now? And what are you? Level 20, okay. Alright, come over here. Take a nibble. That way. Thank you. Now you should follow me more. If something is hit you, they tend to follow you longer without losing aggro than if you've never been hit at all. It's like they think they have a chance or something. Yeah, I just auto-harvested that thing as well. The Ichthyosaur. Alright, run. Tender young baby. You're full health again. Nice. Oh, dang it. No. Buddies are coming over now, too. Great. Ah. and you were a 140. Oh well. You are experience points and fish meat. And yes, it did knock out. Okay. Your high stat is oxygen. Who cares? Uh, oxygen on a shark. Really? I think we're good. Get the hell out of here. All right, so that's the 130. You had 28 points into health. Yeah, we're definitely taming you. Actually, I might need Prime to help finish teaming that last Megalodon, because I've only got five kibble left and they take three each. I can get Prime off of you. 132 Prime fish meat. Dang it. Um, I do have regular Prime. Okay, cool. These stupid Ichthyosaurs, man. It's like three donkeys, just like in close proximity here.
Shove off, you jerks. Get our one fifty. That was a pleasy sword doing at the surface. You just hit my shark, you jerk. Me on. Hey, you know what? Might turn you into an undersea taming bin. Actually, plus these are nice because they are fast. They, I usually don't tame them though because they just look really, really goofy. Especially their head. time. Thank you. You're losing taming percentage because, well, stuff happened. You did not get hit though. Okay, sweet. You know what? Oh, hi. Um, I nope, that's bad. almost pushed me into the freaking Nidaria there. Alright, everything's tamed. I am giving up on a Bazillosaur for right now. It's been way too long doing this, and I am basically leaving it now because of sharks. Oh yeah, you leveled up again. Sweet. Thousand percent melee. Nice. Actually, here, you get to keep that last bit for yourself. Ah, all right. And now let's go look at everything I sent back already. Yeah. <laughs> Including all of that meat. We're set on fish meat for a long time. Also, actually, I want to move this oil into my furnace. 
Hunting Forge, what do you want to call it? Okay, but we pull, hide. Um, is that that? You know, just pull that out too. There we go. I'm gonna make a stupid amount of gasoline because I can. Uh, there's only 50 stacks of room, or 50 slots, in the refining torch. has its own little baggie over here. Yeah. And I'll put the rest of the stuff away in a bit. Actually, I want to get this moved first. I did run into one ammonite, so I want to get that into a pantry. Actually, here that was more spoiled, so there we go. And it's got five hours until one piece spoils. Okay, cool. Alright, now, this is the fun part. We have to sort all of the stats and everything. So we're just going to drop all the megalodons I just tamed. Quite a few. Here, let me leave. I'll at least put a shirt on, right? Okay. So, we have a 40 health. Okay, is there anything better? I doubt it. Yeah. Oh, wait a second. We have a 43. This is the one we just tamed up the 130. Okay, so 43 health. Melee. Wow, you came at 40 and 40. Look at that. So 40 melee. 42 melee. 42. Okay, we'll go ahead and grab this one because I can read those two together. That'll give him 5,700 health and 442% melee. Any other stats I want? Weight might not be bad. Stamina would be good. If I'm riding around on one anyway. A 34 stamina I think is our highest so far. 40 stamina. Yep, that's probably our highest. And then... 38 weight... Nine weights. Okay. Unless you have a 40. No. Alright. So that means we can get rid of those. We're going to keep these four guys here. All slow. Right now I'm just trying to get mutations on my Rex line, so it's like. Melee. Uh, what do I need? I needed melee. All right, cool. That means I can stop breeding my Rexes now, too, because I've got all the females I need. Although, at the same time, I have been using them to uh, level creatures up. So. <laughs> like this one. I uh, tamed another thorny dragon and bred it with the male that I've been using since, you know, I first went to the volcano. Oh, hiccup. Felt that one coming too, which made it even worse. And yeah. So at least now I have an imprint of Thorny Dragon to get wood with and stuff. If, you know, I decide to keep doing that. But I think I'm going to go ahead and call this an episode. Um, next episode, I need to make a breeding pin. Because I, I don't have one. 
I've been doing all my breeding here, and it's just honestly... Yeah. Not the greatest. I'm running out of room. I think actually I might end up making an entire new base while I'm at it. Uh, what was I going to put into the smithy? Oh yeah, my armor so I can repair it. The only downside with Desert Cloth is the durability just seems really kind of crappy compared to everything else. Right, 630, 630 durability. 666, but it just seems to just break so much more often. Well, I mean, this thing breaks freaking in a heartbeat. But it's only got 45 durability, so. I need to get some kibble together and go tame that Plessy, too. Yeah, I should probably do that. But, thank you for coming out. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and until the next one. Sign signing out. Have fun.